Sida in full means controlled internal drug release. So our progesterone is, is impregnated in what we call a sida. A sida is a device that contains progesterone. So because these animals are cycling at different times of the month, and we do want to pull to bring all the cycles closer such that they, uh, they start cycling at the same time. So what we do, we insert the cedar device in the vaginal part of our animals. The cedar is going to stay in the animal body for five to seven days. So in the process or in the period of five to seven days, these animals that have a CL, a functional CL, Copacerytium, all that the animals that do, do not have a functional CL will uh, take advantage of the period of five to seven days to develop or to establish a functional CL. So at the end of the five, and, five to seven days, all these animals are going to be picking pregnancy. They will assume, the brain is going to assume that this animal is pregnant for the five to seven days. So in the process, it will establish a functional CL. So at the end of the seven days, on removal of the cedar, all these animals will be responsive, or responsive to another hormone that we call prostaglandin. When we now administer prostaglandin, then all these animals are going to start cycling at the same time. So, uh, artificially, as we do extra synchronization, the cedar, which is uh, progesterone, is going to help us actually bring all these animals. Estrus is going to, all the estrus cycle is going to be paused for five to seven days. In the process of the, in the, in the period of five to seven days, we are establishing a functional CL, which CL is going to be responsive to uh, prostaglandin. Prostaglandin is the hormone that is now going to help us regress the established corpus luteum to enable a normal cycling or induced cycling at the end of the seven days.